Well, we want you to meet Humphrey, a very tired dog. He is the latest addition to the Houston Fire Department's arson division, sniffing out evidence at fire scenes across town. That's right. Humphrey wants a belly rub right you about now. Know. Tonight, Local 2's Jace Larson goes on scene with Humphrey and his handler showing us what it takes for this super dog to make the squad. Like any dog. Sit. Ready? Go get it. Humphrey loves a day at the park. You ready? Go get it. Playing fetch with his pal Greg. They're with me 24 7. Yeah. But this isn't just your run of the mill tale about a man's best friend. Humphrey, just like a superhero, comes with his very own super vest, poster, even trading cards. In fact, Greg would say Humphrey has superpowers. All I got to do is tell him what I want him to do, and the dog will do everything he can to, to help me do what I need to do. Humphrey is the Houston Fire Department's newest four legged rookie. He's trained to sniff out where flames may have started. You go in a big building, one room, a huge room, and they're there just to find and detect a small amount of accelerant underneath all the fire debris. His nose is fine tuned for crime fighting. You know, we smell a hamburger, it's a hamburger. A dog can smell. The lettuce, the tomato, the onion, the meat, the bun, they smell all of the different uh, pieces of that hamburger. He joined the force just months ago after Greg's other super dog, Oliver, hung up his cape. You know, I'm used to Oliver working slow and, and a steady pace. And this young dog is, you know, real energetic. And I got it's hard to keep up with him. See, he can't sit still. Oliver was on the job for eight years. I've never been as close to a dog like I have with Oliver. Both Humphrey and Oliver trained for three months at a special academy in Virginia. The ATF provides the money and the training for these dogs. People think a dog is a bomb sniffing dog and a drug sniffing dog and an accelerant dog. And in fact, dogs, just like people, have specialties. These accelerant canines, they are in a very specialized field of accelerant dogs. If you want a bomb sniffing dog, you go to a different dog. And there are only a handful of these specially trained canines like Humphrey and Oliver in the whole country. I tell you why it's a big deal for the city of Houston. They get this national resource, of which there are very few in America as well as abroad, in the city of Houston, in their city, to investigate cases. But at the end of the day, after Humphrey and Oliver's superhero work for the city is over, they are, after all, Greg's best friends. As soon as we get home, I sit down on the couch, relax, watch TV. They're sitting right here at my foot. If I get up to go somewhere else, they get up and want to follow me. A trio that's helped keep Houston safe. Jace Larson, KPRC Local 2. <laughs> and Humphrey's had a busy day today, yeah. you guys. He was up at that Willis House fire That's investigating right. up there today. So what yeah. does he what does he look for when he got I mean, how does that work? Well, Gregory here, Chapa from uh, the Arson Division. I'll lean in so you can talk into my mic, Gregory. Well, he's trained to search for accelerants, you know, such as gasoline, lighter fluid. So he just goes and smells and, and, and whatever he does. He figure out when, what he, when he uh, finds uh, an accelerant, he's trained to sit. And he'll sit. Oh. And then uh, I'll ask him to show me, and he'll point with his nose where the accelerant is. And y'all take it from there? Yes, sir. Wow. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Great yeah, dog. Amazing. And, and Humphrey's a young and only two years yeah, old. That's yeah, why that's he's right. got so much energy. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's not only a very uh, smart dog, very sweet as well. Oh, he's great. Yeah. He's great. What a, yeah, what a I notice member. who he likes best. It's not you. <laughs> I know. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I need to put on a red dress. We've been bonding. <laughs>